Hi, this is uh, Commander Chris Hadfield, uh, astronaut and someone who's really excited to see that Haza al-Mansouri is flying to space. Haza, it is so important what you're doing. Uh, not just personally for you, not just professionally in your own career, but the real big impact is global. Uh, you represent the hopes and dreams of millions of Arabs, Arabic speaking people, as well as uh, children all around the world. You're, you're a role model for those people to make different choices with their lives. That's what's so important about international cooperation, allowing people to see an opportunity they didn't know existed for them. I'm going to step off the land now. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. It was hugely influential for me as a kid to see the first people flying in space and go to the moon. And it changed my decision making, and you're doing that exact same thing. Without gravity, of course, you don't need anything to hold you up. You can just completely relax, and you don't even need a pillow. In space, you don't even have to hold your head up. Ground control to Major Tom. Ground control to Major Tom. Lock your Soyuz hatch and put your helmet on. Put more water in. And so if you keep crying, you just end up with a bigger and bigger ball of solar. I think there's three important things you need to remember. Number one is be good at your job. Do the work. Be competent. You have to focus and do every single thing as well as any human being can do. You've got a background to do all those things. You're working like hard. I like crazy hard on it, I know. But, but you have to do that as job one. Your job is to be the best astronaut that's ever flown in space. The second is be a good crew member, a good teammate. Support the team members from all the other countries and organizations, all of the people supporting you on the ground. Build a team of people that can cooperatively together do something that nobody else can do. And you're sort of at the, the pointy end of the spear for that. The third important point after, of course, being good at your job and building a, a really good and cooperative and capable team is share the experience. Don't, don't keep any of it to yourself. Share it now in advance. Share it on the day of launch. Think about how you can let other people in on what's going through your own mind. What does it feel like? And, and during the flight, seek every opportunity to not just squander it and make it your own, but, but to let other people in on the magic of this brand new human experience. And then of course afterwards, uh, your legacy will live for decades right across the UAE, across the Arab world, and, and around our whole planet. So, so make sure that you're really noticing all the fine detail, having fun in it, and loving it, and then sharing that, that joy and that love and that technical depth with as many people as you can. You're changing your own life. You're changing, to some degree, the future of human capability. But it's the lives of the future that you're changing are the really important ones. Have a great voyage. I look forward to talking to you, maybe while you're in space, but definitely when you land back on Earth. Bon voyage.